Hi, uh, in this video I'm going to illustrate uh, default methods for interfaces. Uh, default method for interfaces is a new feature uh, added in Java 8. Uh, with this feature, uh, now non-abstract uh, methods can be added to interfaces uh, by using the, the default keyword. Uh, so earlier, before Java 8, uh, it was not possible uh, to add an implemented method in an interface, uh, but now with with Java 8, uh, you can do that. Uh, so I have a simple example here. This is the calculator interface. As you can see, it has an abstract method calculate, which has not been implemented here. But then I have uh, this sum method here, which, uh, as you can see. Uh, it has uh, been in implemented in this this calculator interface so uh, it's possible to do that now however uh, you need to use the the default keyword for for doing this so let let me go to eclipse to to illustrate this further with an example so here i have a, a simple uh, default method test class and I have uh, this calculator interface here. Uh, it has this abstract method calculate. And then we have the, the non-abstract uh, method sum, uh, which has been implemented here. It's a simple method. It takes in two parameters, A and B, and simply does a sum of, uh, of the two and, and returns it back. And of course, you need the, the default keyword uh, for doing this in an interface uh, let me show you what happens you know if you remove the, the default keyword uh, you'll see that the compiler Im immediately complains because you cannot uh, have a implemented method without without the default keyword so let me let me add it back save it uh, so next i have uh, this main method here to to illustrate it further so here uh, I have uh, I'm using this uh, anonymous inner class to implement this uh, calculator interface. So this is the anonymous inner class implementing the calculator interface. So here uh, the calculate method uh, is being implemented, which is which is an abstract method in the in the interface. So it's being implemented here. And note that uh, from from this implementation of the calculate method, we can invoke the sum method, which which was you know already implemented uh, in the interface. So it, it's possible to to call the sum method from from within this implementation. And so now that we have this uh, instance of calculator, which is and uh, an uh, anon implementation of the anonymous um, inner class, uh, you know, implementing the, the calculator interface. So we have uh, this instance of calculator, uh, and so we can now call, we can either call the, the calculate method, which was just implemented here, or we can uh, also call the, the sum method which was already available to us uh, because it has it was already implemented in the in the interface so let me run this simple example so as you can see uh, in the first case, uh, the calculate method wa was called. So it printed uh, calculate, start calculate. And then from within calculate, we called the sum method. So it printed that, start sum. And then finally, it printed the result of the sum 5 plus 6, 11. Uh, in the second case, we are calling the sum method uh, directly. And so it just printed the start sum here, and it printed uh, the sum, which is 11. So this was a simple example uh, or a simple illustration of the of the default uh,
keyword using which we can we can have a non abstract method in an interface thanks for uh, watching this uh, video